Hello, hello, hello. I'm back today with another pick a deck reading. This time um, I'm using two decks, the Wisdom of the Oracle deck and the Spirit Animal uh, deck. So think about think about a problem that you need advice on. All right. Think about it for a second and then pick a deck. OK, so the deck that you pick, uh, how do you know which one to pick? The energy will feel different. OK, you look at both of them. One of their energy will stand out. All right. So pause the video if you need and make your choice. All right. I'm going to go with the first deck, which is the Wisdom Oracle deck. All right. So. All right. What does what is the advice? What is the advice for the issue the subscriber is dealing with? What is the advice? Give me one card for the advice. Please, for the subscriber. Okay, please give me one card for advice. Please give me one card for the advice for the issue the subscriber is dealing with. Please give me one card. Please give me one card. Please give me one card. Okay. All right. Two of them fell. Regeneration. All right. So whatever this issue is, all right, whatever this is, you're coming out of it. You're coming out of it. There is an ending here. This is an ending and a new beginning. All right. So from the ashes, something new is growing. So you are growing out of uh, the an ending. There is a new beginning. All right. Very nice. So the advice for you, I guess, would be to focus on the growth and to let go of what is not for you and to focus on the growth that's trying to come in. Okay. And the next, the card that just fell out is go the distance. So whatever a uh, new thing that is starting the new beginning has capacity to be long term okay if it's a business idea or it's just a way of living or uh, anything it has the potential to be bring you uh, long term growth okay so very nice cards so these are the advice cards but now let me clarify them with um, gilded tarot all right please clarify regeneration please clarify regeneration please clarify regeneration Thank you. Please clarify regeneration. Thank you. All right. So this is the, the star. So whatever this regeneration is, it has potential to bring you uh, into the limelight. It has potential for great success. All right. So whatever this new beginning is, it's going, it's a wish fulfillment. It could have been a wish of yours. Or this has a potential, if this is a project or something that you're starting, it has potential to bring you recognition. All right. Really nice cards. Really nice. Okay. Go the distance. Please clarify. Go the distance. Please clarify. Go the distance. Eight of Wands. Communication. Communication about uh, maybe a project that's coming your way. Communication about a business offer. Communication about something that has long-term growth potential all right so let's see why is the star here why is the star here as part of advice for deck one why is the star here two of swords you have been caught up in a stagnant uh, self-sabotaging situation you have refused to see the truth or you did not see the truth for a very long time you were caught in this but now coming out of this coming out of this into clarity coming out of this into healing and coming out of this into growth new growth for you yourself all right so eight of wands please clarify eight of wands please clarify eight of wands please clarify eight of wands two of pentacles you were probably uh caught up in uh, a situation where you were just considered like an option by somebody or you were juggling between two choices. Should I do this? Should I do that? Should I like pick this, pick that? So coming out of that into communication, swift movement forward. So maybe more information is going to come your way. That's going to help you make a decision. Okay. So what is the best possible outcome for people who pick deck one? What is the best possible outcome, please? What is the best possible outcome for people who picked pile one? Deck one, sorry. What is the best possible outcome ace of pentacles wow okay does it get any better than this so whatever this delay was whatever this setback was 
that took you a while to get out of right it really uh my intuitively i'm sensing that this really look uh, took a big chunk out of you shook you up shook your stability up but now you're slowly coming back to yourself you're healing and you are again beginning to get back into the love for life right and so now this is a new growth opportunity that's coming your way ace of pentacles is growth this is money this has potential to be again long term growth okay so this is what i have for you good luck all right so now let's do pile 2 all right pile 2 oh i was going to use look at me all right i was going to use the <laughs> spirit animal deck right okay so here we go what is the advice please give me one card for advice for people who picked deck 2 please give me one card for advice for people who pick deck 2 please give me one card is advice for people who pick deck 2 please give me one card for advice for people who pick deck 2 please give me one card please give me one card thank you this one is sticking out think on your feet think on your feet maybe a tricky situation that you're dealing with where you have to be little quick maybe uh a tricky person a person who doesn't show you their true colors or a situation that could be that is not really uh you don't know everything there is in about the situation there could be a lot of hidden information so needing to be quick on your feet all right this can also be the, uh, looked at as being uh, think on your feet because there could be opportunities that you could be missing so keep an eye out all right So let's see what is the second card for advice for deck 2. What is the second card please for advice for deck 2? What is the second card please for advice for deck 2? What is the second card? What is the second card for advice for deck 2? Okay, what is this? Okay. Ha, ah, two of them are stuck together. Hmm. All right. So I'm going to I'm going to put them back. I don't do cards that are stuck together. Okay, please give me Please give me one more card. Please give me one more card for the messages for people who picked deck two for advice. Please give me one more card. Please give me one more card. One more card. All right. Armadillo spirit set healthy boundaries. Okay. Armadillo spirit set healthy boundaries. So fox spirit is think on your feet. Armadillo spirit set healthy boundaries. That tells me that you could be somebody who needs to work on your boundaries. they could be people around you who are taking advantage of your goodness of your nice nature of your helpful nature so needing to set a boundary this can also be uh so when you don't have boundaries what happens let's talk about that for a second all right so what happens when you don't have boundaries because you are a giving person you want to give but you don't have boundaries people take advantage of you then it is just that you are not really considering yourself worthy enough to put boundaries for yourself okay so so that doesn't help anybody so get into get some boundaries for yourself i'm going to clarify this with the rider weight deck all right so fox spirit think on your feet please clarify 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 think on your feet a heavy burden okay so end of a heavy cycle there's something that you've been dealing with that has been weighing very heavily on you you're ready to put this burden down another way to look at it is because of all the wands because you're so close to the problem because this person's face is almost in the wands you don't know where you're going where you're headed or how big or small the problem is so needing to detach yourself needing to create a distance between yourself and the problem for a bit so you get a different perspective and hopefully thereby a solution all right so that's one way to look at it that's what is speaking very loudly to me here um armadillo spirit why is armadillo spirit in the spirit for people who picked deck 2 why is armadillo spirit in the spread for people who put deck 2 why is armadillo spirit in the deck for pile 2 for deck 2 all right waiting for your ships to come in this is someone who is waiting 
sorry this is someone who wants to enter partnership with you or this could be you looking into new beginnings right the world is in your hand you're like after this heavy burden something what am i going to create what am i going to create now right but needing to start off with if it's a new relationship then making sure that your boundaries are in place all right so but let me clarify again uh, why is the ten of wands here why is 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 ten of wands here okay nice so putting that burden down so you can move towards the stability on the home front or stable foundation so move putting this burden down so you can move towards putting this burden down so you can move towards this uh stable energy all right very nice okay let's see what is two of and look at this two of wands and four of wands definitely whatever you're wishing to create here you're getting it here all right whatever you're creating here with the world in your hand you're getting it here very nice i'm going to clarify the two of wands anyway please clarify two of wands 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 knight of cups okay somebody coming back with an apology or an offer of love or just communication all right emotional communication let me put it that way so you needing to make sure that if it's the past person needing to be mindful and needing to use your intuition to see if this person belongs in your life or not okay definitely don't just needing to look very carefully at the offer that's coming your way all right so that's all i have for you today thank you for watching